After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. I thought Kemsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. Kemsky was just playing with me. He didn't know anything. Did Kemsky design this place? He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? Why did Kemsky leave Cyberlife? What happened? It's an old story, Connor. It doesn't pertain to your investigation. Where does Cyberlife stand in all this? What do they really want? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. Have you experienced anything unusual recently? Any doubts or conflicts? Do you feel anything for these deviants? Or for Lieutenant Anderson? I'm beginning to have thoughts that are not part of my program. Maybe... Maybe I've been compromised too. You're off the case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're on to something. Wait, we just need more time, I'm sure we Hank, can... you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now, not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide and the android returns to Cyberlife. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. Hank, what are you doing? Something I should have done a long time ago. Listen, take a few days to think it over. There's no rush. I thought enough about it. I'm tired of going through the motions. There's nothing keeping me here, not this case. Not my partner. I don't belong here anymore. I got him. Jesus Christ. How'd he manage to get out of his cell? No fucking idea. Come on, you. Get to move on.
Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? I've been removed from the case. I'm going to register the evidence in my possession, and then I'm going to leave. Good. Be careful on your way back. Androids have a tendency of uh, getting themselves set on fire these days. Hank's password. What would a hard-boiled eccentric police lieutenant choose? Obviously. Where is Jericho? The answer's here somewhere. Not much time. Gotta think fast. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Marcus, where are you hiding? Jericho. If I could just figure out where this memory was recorded. Rupert's diary, but it's useless. It's encrypted. One of the deviants that hacked the TV station with Marcus. It must have known where the deviants are hiding. Deviant who took a child hostage. It's dark. Where... Where am I? I'm a deviant. Like you. I need your help. I want to go to Jericho. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. 
But I will never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Who's there? Who are you? Everything is all right. Don't worry. Marcus, is that you? Why did you leave me? I had no choice. They'd have killed us all. You'll be all right. I came to take you home. Just give me the location to Jericho. You've got to leave now. Jericho. Yes. Yes, of course. Again, Marcus, don't leave. Looks like someone's been snooping around. Oh, shit. Get the alarm now. <laughs> <laughs> 